the open golf at St Andrews again. The Minister of Food replies to a question which lots of housewives are anxious to ask him. Mr Strachey, why has it become necessary to ration bread? Well, the reason we've got to ration bread is because we're short of wheat. And what I mean by that is that our stock of wheat in the next six weeks will come to a point at which if certain things happened and if we didn't ration, we should get or risk a breakdown in the distribution of bread. And that we're not going to risk. The things I mean are things like a strike of the dockers in America loading the wheat or a bad crop in this country a wet August which would mean a late harvest or bad conditions in the Canadian prairies. Now none of those things may happen but they might happen and so I refuse to risk a breakdown in the distribution of bread here and the way I can prevent that risk is to ration. Now about the rationing scheme itself. I think people will find that they'll get enough bread, but if they don't, remember that a family can get more bread by sacrificing points. Or vice versa, a family which finds it doesn't need all the ration can get some extra points. So the scheme is flexible. Coming back to the necessity of rationing, wouldn't you agree that no government would dream of doing anything as unpopular as rationing bread must obviously be unless we'd come to the conclusion it was absolutely necessary as a safeguard to see that every family in this country was sure of its share of bread. And one thing you can rely on, we shall take off bread rationing the very moment it's no longer necessary. <laughs>